Welcome to the pulsating rhythm of the cosmos, where music and entertainment stories collide. This is Star TV, your interstellar guide brought to you by Galaxy Labels. From the latest chart toppers to the hidden gems of the universe, we've got the exclusive story. Stay tuned as the stars align to bring you the news that's lighting up the entertainment galaxy. Get ready to embark on a journey where sound meets space. Welcome to Star TV, where we discuss everything from the comebacks to the latest drama among the stars. Starting today's show, popular girl group Athena is gearing up for their second of three highly anticipated releases before their disbandment at the end of July. The group has been building excitement among fans by releasing the first music video teaser. These stunning visuals have already garnered a lot of attention and have fans eagerly awaiting more. The upcoming track titled Devil is expected to be released on June 20th. This release is part of Athena's farewell to their fans, marking the end of an era for the beloved group. Stay tuned for more updates on Athena's final releases as we bid them a heartfelt goodbye. And now, moving on to our next story. Galaxy Entertainment has announced that girl group Sakura will be disbanding at the end of August. The company released a statement just an hour ago expressing gratitude to the group and their fans for the incredible four years together. In the statement, Galaxy Entertainment confirmed that Sakura will be releasing one final mini album before the end of their contracts, giving fans one last gift from the beloved group. This news follows closely on the heels of Sakura's recent comeback on the 15th with their title track, Villain, marking their first return to the stage after a 19-month hiatus. The announcement has stirred mixed emotions among fans who are cherishing these final moments with Sakura. Stay tuned as we bring more updates on Sakura's upcoming mini album and their final activities. Now, let's shift our focus to some exciting news. Several Galaxy artists are gearing up for comebacks in the next two weeks, promising a whirlwind of new releases and exciting content for fans. Kicking off comeback season, Queen Toxic will be returning with their fifth mini album, Siren Dawn, on the 21st, accompanied by a thrilling comeback trailer. It is during our darkest moments that we must focus to see the light. Zero is making a strong return with their seventh mini album on the 22nd. They've already given a fan a preview with the pre release of My My on the 11th. Lakuna is releasing the Japanese version of Undercover on the 22nd, which will include the Japanese versions of their hits Undercover, O, oh, Getaway, and Trigger. After a six month hiatus, Universe will be back with their sixth mini album and on the 28th. All Around Music's Rising Solos, Iris will be dropping her second digital single, Desperado, on the 25th. Eternal is set to release their newest single, Coffee Shop, on the 27th. Galaxy Labels Japan's second girl group, Zephyria, is making their first comeback with their second single, Mascara, on the 29th. Muse is preparing for a return with their third Japanese album, Perfect World, set to release on July 28th. Fans can look forward to the music video for the title track, Perfect World, on June 30th. All Around Music soloist Alexios is making his long-awaited comeback with the EP, It's Not Your Fault, featuring the title track, Yo Nam Dong, featuring Lil Boy on the 26th. It's to the mountain, Nebula Records soloist Aria has announced her comeback with the release of a short performance video for upcoming B-side, Summer Heat. Her third mini-album, Showdown, is expected to be released on July 3rd. Lastly, 
Lastly, Adora will be releasing their second pre-release track, Life's Too Short, on the 24th. This song will be a part of their upcoming second mini-album, Girls. In our next segment, we bring you the latest updates on several lineup changes that have taken place within groups under Galaxy Entertainment and Nebula Records. These changes have been unfolding over the past couple of months and involve a number of well-known groups. Starting with Zeus, the youngest member, Mikey, has left the group. He has been replaced by Ju Kang Sun, a former contestant on Project Deja Vu in Crown Season 2. Kang Sun made his debut with Zeus in their latest Japanese single, Love Train. Next, Kings has undergone significant changes with members Jin, Zane, Joon, and Jun departing for various reasons. They have all been replaced by former Crown Season 2 contestants Daesung, Ayato, Ezekiel, and Taeyong. These new members were introduced during their collaboration with Amoeba Culture on the track Save. Promise has also seen some changes with Mi Kyung leaving the group over the past year. She has been replaced by Jung Suri, a former Crown Season 1 contestant and Polaris member as the newest main vocalist. The group had been searching for another main vocalist before Mi Kyung's departure but decided to proceed as an 8 member group to avoid delaying their first album. Universe, formed through the 2019 survival show Cosmos, has introduced former Cosmos and Crown Season 1 contestant Ellen Zhao to the group, following the departure of 9th Rink member Song Jimin due to personal reasons. Dora has seen Eddie leave the group in early spring with Teddy from Empyrean stepping in. Nebula Records and Galaxy Labels Japan have announced that Adora is now a joint venture between both labels, integrating members from both Zephyra and Empyrean. Teddy's first appearance in Adora was with their pre-release single Illusion on June 3rd. Kui Toxic saw Jordan leave in May after their April release to focus on his home life. Former Project Deja Vu and Crown Season 2 contestant Jung Tuk has joined the group just in time for their June 21st comeback. Hero has had Youngmin leave the group due to creative differences. He has been replaced by Charlie Jung, a former member of Axis. Charlie participated in the Glass Dimension in 2022 and moved to All Around Music to focus on his solo career in 2024. He then participated in Crown Season 2, representing All Around Music. After his elimination, Charlie was asked to join Hero following Youngmin's departure. <laughs> Wisteria has had Chloe and Rico leave the group for personal reasons, and they have been replaced by former Cosmos and Crown Season 1 contestants Hazel and Kuti. Genesis Eva has left the group for health reasons and has been replaced by Jung Ji Hyun, a former Crowd Season 1 contestant and Eclipse member.
Eclipse experienced a shift with Jayma leaving due to musical differences. She has been replaced by Una from Black Rose, who made her debut with Eclipse for their May 25th comeback first. Finally, Aurelia and Solio have seen Evelyn leave both groups due to health reasons. Aurelia will continue as a six-member group with Blaze returning from hiatus after participating in Crown Season 1 last year. And Solio, former Crown Season 1 contestant Ami, has joined the group. These lineup changes mark a period of transition and renewal for these groups as they continue to evolve and grow in their musical journeys. We will be sure to keep you updated on their progress in new releases. Nebula Records has released the opening trailer for Alana's highly anticipated solo debut. Early morning on the 17th, the trailer dropped, giving a sneak peek into what promises to be an unforgettable launch. Alana, known for her captivating performances in Wisteria, will be releasing her first mini album titled I'm Alana on June 24th. This debut album will feature a total of seven songs, including two exciting collaborations that have fans buzzing with anticipation. With her solo venture, Alana is set to showcase her unique artistry and musical style, offering a fresh and personal touch to what will undoubtedly leave a mark on the industry. Stay tuned as we continue to bring you the latest updates on Alana's journey and all the excitement leading up to her debut. Shifting gears, Nebula Records is making headlines with the announcement of their newest girl group, currently in the final stages of preparation. While details remain sparse, Nebula has revealed that the group will consist of seven members, all of whom are the same age. This mystery surrounding the group has sparked intense curiosity among fans and industry insiders alike. With Nebula Records known for their producing top tier talent, anticipation is running high for what this new ensemble will bring to the table. Be sure to stay tuned to Star TV for the latest updates and exclusive insights into Nebula Records' highly anticipated girl group. As soon as more information becomes available, we'll bring it straight to you. All Around Music is gearing up to introduce their third soloist this year. Following the successful debuts of Kiritani Masaru and Iris Han just last month, anticipation is building as they prepare to unveil another talented female soloist. Details about the new artist remain under wraps, but keen-eyed fans have spotted her frequenting the AAM building. Speculation is rife among fans suggest that she might be a former contestant from Crown Season 1. However, All Around Music has yet to confirm her identity or provide any official details. As excitement continues to mount, stay tuned for more updates and announcements from All Around Music regarding their newest soloist. We'll be sure to bring you all the latest information as soon as it becomes available. In breaking news, Sonetto has made headlines with significant changes to their lineup. Charlotte Chen, a member since Sonetto's debut in January, has been officially removed from the group by Nebula Records. Charlotte's tenure in Sonetto has been marred by controversy, with ongoing opposition stemming from her behavior during Crown Season 1. This doesn't intensify when fellow members Hitomi and Griso took to Instagram to express their concerns about group dynamics and lack of cohesion. Despite initial worries about eternal discord within the group, it has been noted that Hitomi, Griso, and Sohei have been frequently seen together throughout their break, conspicuously without Charlotte. Confirming Charlotte's departure, Nebula Records stated that she has left the company as of the end of May. Moving forward, Sonetto will continue as a cohesive unit with four members. To fill the void left by Charlotte, Nebula Records has enlisted Tamashiro Suzume, a former Girls Planet 999 contestant and soloist who also participated in Crown Season 1 as their newest main vocalist. Fans can anticipate Sonetto's return with their first maxi single scheduled for release on July 6. As the group navigates this transition, all eyes will be on their upcoming release and how they evolve with their new lineup.
In further developments, Banyan has undergone significant changes with the removal of member Huayang from the group. Huayang, who faced opposition from the outset due to her behavior on Crown Season 1, reportedly showed little improvement in attitude following her elimination and subsequent debut with Vanyan. Internal dynamics within Vanyan has been strained with members like Zoe, Eden, Elysia, and Nyla subtly expressing their reluctance to continue working with Huayang. Those familiar with Huayang's demeanor during Crown Season 1 recall her strong-willed nature and singular focus on personal goals irrespective of others' opinions or group dynamics. Confirming her departure, Vanyan's management announced that Huayang had left the company in early June. Moving forward, Vanyan will proceed as a cohesive five-member group. As the group prepares to move past this chapter, fans are eager to see how Vanyan will evolve and continue to showcase their talents. We'll keep you updated on any new developments regarding Vanyan and its future plans. As we near the conclusion of an exhilarating journey, Crowned, the search for the next boy group royalty, is set to wrap up its second season. After 11 intense weeks of competition, the top 18 contestants were determined on Friday. Fans and viewers alike are eagerly awaiting the upcoming finale scheduled for Friday, June 21st. It's been confirmed that the top 18 finalists will showcase their talents with two brand new songs specifically prepared for the occasion. However, details regarding the producer of the songs have yet to be disclosed. Stay tuned to Crown for all the latest updates and performances as we count down to the highly anticipated finale. In a surprising turn of events, Galaxy Labels is set to revive its modeling division after nearly five years of dormancy. Previously, Galaxy Entertainment housed a modeling department which was ultimately closed on September 4th, 2019 to redirect focus toward their idol and acting sectors. However, as of June 10th, Galaxy Labels have been actively preparing to unveil Galaxy Labels The Walk, aimed at nurturing aspiring print and runway models. The initiative marks a significant pivot back into the modeling industry, signaling Galaxy Label's commitment to diversifying its portfolio and supporting talent across various entertainment fields. For those eager to delve into the world of modeling under Galaxy Label's guidance, anticipation is high for the official opening of the walk. Be sure to stay tuned to Galaxy Label's for more unique and exciting development. Wrapping up tonight's broadcast, Galaxy Labels is making significant strides in expanding its acting department following a period of re-evaluation. In response to the industry's evolving landscape, Galaxy Labels has introduced Galaxy Labels The Film, a strategic initiative aimed at bolstering the careers of their talented actors and providing enhanced opportunities under this new banner. This move underscores Galaxy Label's commitment to fostering growth and creativity within their acting division. As Galaxy Label's the film nears its final stages of preparation, industry insiders anticipate its official launch with keen interest. For aspiring actors and fans alike, keep a close watch on Galaxy Label's for updates regarding the official opening of the film. This promising development promises to redefine the landscape of acting under Galaxy Label's esteemed banner. That's all for today's broadcast. Remember to stay tuned to Star TV for all the latest news and updates from Galaxy Labels, including new releases and exciting developments in the entertainment world. For all your Galaxy Labels news and drama, Star TV has you covered. Thank you for watching and have a great day.